Hello. I didn't mean to do that. I was trying to plug in my controller so I could use my microphone on it. Um, and it accidentally changed the desktop audio output. Oops. But hi. We're playing Undertale finally. In the moment, what do you what do you think your soul would represent? Um Like how it was patience, bravery, integrity, pers perseverance, kindness, justice, and determination. Um, chaos. Anyways, let's play Undertale. I've been meaning to do this for so long. I, I just want to mention that. Um, I have been... This audio... Oh, that's very loud. Um, I have been meaning to play this for, I don't know, about two years now. Maybe almost three. No, it's been three. And um, I did stream it one time back in December 2018, I think. Um, but I was stupid back then and my voice sounded dumb, so I, I kind of deleted, or I kind of privated all those old streams, and that was also the Steam version, which is bad. Um, Chaos is a brown heart. <laughs> um, hmm. I'm trying to figure out how I want to do audio for this. But, yeah, I really like this game. I used to really not like it because it was popular, and that was my only reason why, because I was a stupid child. Um, but I, I can see it for what it is now, and I'm very nostalgic for this game, <laughs> despite my history with it. And I'm excited to finally stream it. Oh. Uh, <laughs> do I? We are all stupid children? Okay. Yeah. A name has already been chosen. Yes, reset? Okay. Purge it. Here we are, baby. Oh yeah. Hi, Flowey. Howdy. What voice do I do for this? Howdy. I'm sorry to flower. I can't do that this whole time. Oh, I can't do this. I have to play on another save. I accidentally just reset for nothing. Kind of wish I was there so I could help dub. <laughs> I could technically do that, yeah. Um, long ago, two races ruled over. Okay, yeah, we already saw all that. Settings, border, dynamic. All right, let's let's do this again, shall we? Um. Hmm. Oh, I only have six letters. Um, 
What stupid name can I fit in six letters? Call the human Moses? No. I will do no such thing. Does this fit? Where have I heard this name before? Wait. I'm gonna go look this up. The baby. I am not naming it that. Um. I don't know. I'll just go with it. You don't know. We're going the new route. Hilda. That's me. All right. Let's try that again now. Okay. I'm just gonna give him a normal voice. I can't think of a funny one. Howdy, I'm Fly. Fly the flower. Hmm. Okay, near the underground. Aren't ya? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. Hey, it's a little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul, the very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak. But you can. Hi friend. Wait, watch this. It's gonna be so cool. Oh, I was gonna schmoove in between them. Dang, the, the text box was covering it up. You idiot, in this world it's kill or be killed. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Dang, I did it on keyboard last night while I was playing. Okay. Yes. What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Uh, do not be afraid, my ch Do Valley Girl for Flowey? Oh my god, that's such a good idea. I'm gonna do that. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if someone has fallen down. You're the first human to come here in a very long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. Also, this song is so nostalgic for me. <sighs> Mother, come here. Let me talk to you. Okay. It's the voice you gave him. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go for that more intentionally next time. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. <laughs> I pressed one of the buttons. Hey, you got me picturing... Flowey is a human country girl with a southern accent. I can do that. I'm fly, fly, fly. <laughs> I can absolutely do that. To make progress here, you'll need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones you need to flip. Working at the farm and tending the horses. Yeah. Stay on the path. Is this a Mega Man sprite game situation where if I go off the path, I will lose and get the bad ending? Well, too bad, because I'm doing that anyways. <laughs> Splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. Dang. I was really hoping that switch would work. Where's my phone?
wait. Oh wait, I found it. We good. But I was listening to this song like all night last night. <laughs> Cause now I'm just thinking about Undertale. <laughs> Okay, phone found. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The procedure is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. for time I will come to resolve the conflict practice talking to the dummy no jokes can be useful for breaking the ice listen to this one what did the skeleton tile tile his roof with shingles well I thought it was amusing I didn't I'm leaving <laughs> oh shoot it actually let me I don't know if you meant I think they got the mystery dope on this playthrough. The hunt? Valley Girl is stereotypical white girls from 1980 to 2000. <laughs> really? Probably with pumpkin spice and fake nails? Cotton heart and a button eye, you are the apple of my eye. You rhymed eye with eye! You can't do that. Oh, Gaster. Oh, I see. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. You won! Yes! I'm so happy with myself. Whoa, wait, oh, oh, I was able to leave before the text box advanced? Really? Life is difficult for this enemy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> ooh. Also, I just realized that Toro has a black outline on her. You can tell because of the way the green, the green lines in the background, like, are blocked out. That's interesting. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. What's the puzzle? This is the puzzle, but. Here, take my hand for a moment. Oh. Lame. I wanted to solve that for myself. Never thought I'd see the day where someone called Gaster a Dilf. Oh. That was very high-pitched and wholesome. Thank you. You've done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of this room by yourself. Forgive me for this. I know where she is. I know where she is. Where is it? Hi. Woman, you will talk to me. Okay, maybe not. Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting in me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business and you must stay al alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you need anything, just call. Be good, all right? No. Call her mom. 
It says Toriel. You only wanted to say hello? Well then, hello. I hope that suffices. it. <laughs> Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous for you to try and solve them yourself. Be good, alright? So she brings that point up, but then doesn't explain how to do them, so I don't get it. <laughs> Hi, Froggit. Froggit didn't understand what you said, but they were flattered anyway. He <laughs> blushes deeply. Dang, my first real battle and I get hit. Wait, one second. I need my water. My throat is already dying. Oh shoot, wait, where is my... Oh, ah, one sec. <laughs> I think that space is an area next to the frog. You should check it out. Get it. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not fight, does not want to fight you, please use some mercy, human. So does that mean that if you... Uh, If you attack it until it's almost dead and then you can spare it, is that what you can do? I'm gonna threaten it. What are you talking about right next to it though? This? I'm taking it. You risk killing it, but I won't. Ah! Ah! <laughs> How did I avoid that? Also, I like those little slats in the wall, as if they're like, return, <laughs> they're like the ball return, but instead it's the fit frisk return. Also, I know I can take more candy, but everybody always does that, so what if I just don't? I'm being different. Uh. Damage is a little RNG. Oh, I see. For no particular reason, which you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Cinnamon or bee scotch? Bee scotch always makes me laugh a little bit. I'm gonna go with cinnamon. I see very much. Or I see. Thank you very much. Hello, this is Toriel. You're not, you're not dislike butterscotch, do you? I know what your preference is, but would you turn it up? If, would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Understood. Three out of four great rocks recommend you push them. I've never had a butterscotch pie, by the way. Like, what's it like? Is it good? Is it disgusting? Pie... <sighs> Oof. Pie makes my head hurt from how how much sugar there is. Like, ugh. Even thinking about it gives me a little bit of a headache. Is 
like, sorry to say, Toro, but I might turn it up. I might turn it down. I remember this puzzle because I am smart. I am smart woman who is very smart. Heck yeah. Haven't had one either. Mode small block the way. Check. Stereotypical, curvaceously attractive, but no brains. I forgot about that line. That's good. Thanks, Sky, for block or for banning that person. Good Sky. Sexy wiggle. <laughs> oh no, I got hit. I was paying too much attention to the literal slime in front of me. Whoa there, partner! He said you can push me around. Hmm, so you're asking me to move over. Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Thanks, girl. I'm gonna compliment one and and uh, threaten the other. <gasps> ah! <laughs> the slime that arouses. Ah, uh, yes. Hmm, you want me to move for some more? Alrighty, how's this? Why'd I move with it? Hmm, that was the wrong direction. Okay, think I got it. Thanks, bucko. Do genocide? No. Not yet. Wait, watch this. Hmm, you want me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. I really am, huh? I didn't mean to do that. This is Toriel. You want to say hello again? Salutations. Is that enough? I haven't gotten to the secret boss of chapter two. Please don't spoil it for me. I'm begging you. It's the Lancer splat all over again. Cheese has been here for quite a long time. Stuck to the table. Mmm, <laughs> delectable. This is Toriel. Are you bored? I should have given you a book. My apologies. Why not use your imagination to divert yourself? Pretend you are a monarch! Sorry though, I, I should probably be quieter. I need to put a limiter on my voice, honestly. Roll over the leaf pile with a fist of iron. Can you do that for me? <laughs> I don't like that these two options are together. The stream makes you want to play Undertale on my PS5. I think I'll do that for sure. Go for it. Call her mom, then flirt. That's terrible. Don't say that. This is Toriel, huh? Did you just call me mom? Well, I suppose. Did that make you happy? To call me mother? Huh, it's almost like the video game mother. The video game series mother. That That's the game that I like. Whoa. Matthew, you sound amazing, but I've heard that I'm way too loud sometimes and I made Tori go deaf yesterday. Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Move it with force. Yeah. Ba -ba -da. This is the song I used for stream intro, except it was slower. Except this is slower. What's going on with the green grids in the background, by the way, for these battles? Like, I don't... I feel that. Check. Attack 10, defense 10. This monster doesn't seem to have a sense of humor. Oh, I'm real funny. Really not feeling how to do it right now, sorry. I've seen all of these things before, but I don't think I've ever actually finished Undertale for myself, so this is interesting. One sec, I'm gonna get my blanket because it's cold.
any of my northerner friends will know that I am a stupid baby when it comes to how cold it is. It is currently 72 degrees and I am very cold. Threat. You give Nabs the book a cool look. I love the cold too. Ah. Oh, I thought it would. Yeah. Too bad I like in touch. Yeah. Flirt. I just weigh you down. Man, this guy is a real Depeche mode, huh? Ow. He gave him to look a patient smile. <laughs> Adds the book, yeah. Until now, just look a little joke. That's what the ones to show you something. Let me try. I call it dabber book. Do you like it? Yeah, I do. Which is why I'm gonna. What if I did that? I'm gonna do it. You give Nash look a cruel look. I knew it. Oh no! Oh, I feel so bad. Ow! The faint odor of ectoplasm permeates the vicinity. I feel really bad now. That was terrible. Mm. Oh yeah, Tori bought me this game like three years ago and I have been meaning to stream it for like years. I'm about to die by the way. Oh god. Ah! Ah! Hilda dies because she threatened Naps the Block. You cannot give up just yet. Hilda, stay determined. Never actually seen that? Yeah, because you're not a terrible person like I am, apparently. I love the smell of ectoplasm in the morning. Even you kind of deserved that? Yeah, that's true. So that's a little, little joke. <laughs> oh shoot, I didn't know you what? What? Yeah, I'll try telegram really quick. Hurt his feelings. Sorry. So wait, what happens if I Okay, so you can hold B to move the heart slower. I never knew that. That's pretty cool. So what happens if I flirt now? Oh no. I usually come to the rooms because there's nobody around. But today I met someone nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Oh. I'm so glad this game doesn't use the right stick, by the way, because my right stick has a... Uh... Oh shoot, you can do Bluetooth audio now, I forgot about that. Um... What? How am I streaming from Switch? I have a capture card. Okay, I swear it doesn't usually work this well. Wait, huh? Okay. I guess my control stick just works just fine now. Okay. Drift fixed. I opened up my Joy-Con earlier and now that the LED doesn't work, but now my drift is no longer a problem, so... 
Looks junior. Attack six, defense six. Don't pick on him. Family name, Eyewalker. Please don't pick on me. Well, y'all know what I gotta do now. You rude little snipe. What if I do it again? <laughs> I'm a terrible human being. Finally, someone gets it. Ow. Face. Ribbit, ribbit. I have heard you are quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now that a yellow monster wears it uh, by a mo <laughs> You know what it means. What do you think of that? The very it's. It is rather helpful. Remember, sparing is just n Maybe one day you'll even have to do it if your name is it. Yellow. Heard using borders can add some color to the, to the world. Seems you can choose them in the settings before you load the, your game. In the Steam version, this talks about pressing F4 to change from full screen to windowed. However, there isn't a frog theme border, so it's just pointless. That's interesting. I played Undertale a few, okay, not very much, but I have, I've seen the entire thing, I just never played it, because I didn't have Steam when it first came out, it was really popular. Curses. Hello? I just realized that it has been a while since I last cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying around here or there. You can pick them up, but not carry more than you need. Someday you might really need- might see something you really like. You won't have room in your pockets for that. <laughs> I love this little thing. Migas. Attack 7, defense 5. It seems evil, but it's just the wrong crowd. Heed the swarm! Ow! Ow! Create the monster candy. Recover 10 HP. Filthy single minder! Ah! Ah! That hurts so much to do. I don't care! Nothing like a alone time. Look at him grooving! Yeah! That's my favorite enemy. And now I can go buy the big, no big donut. And now my throat hurts from doing that voice. A jug? What will I do with only one? Wait, where'd you see flower? Huh? Wait, where? When you walk, you get a donut. Okay. I've never seen that. Also, I know which one this is. It's this one! Oh. Mmm, cha cha cha. Heck yeah. It's this one, isn't it? Yeah! Oh! I was almost right. I fell down a hole, now I can't get up. Go on without me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. Cha-cha real smooth. To the left. Take it back now, y'all. One hop this time. One hop this time. 
left foot, right stomp. <laughs> or, I don't remember. Eat your greens. Everybody clap your hands. Clap, clap. Vegetoid. Attack six, defense six, serving size one monster not monitored by the USDA. Fresh morning taste. Ah. Talk. Plants can't talk, dummy. You pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. Ooh. I want. I wanted the greens. Tried to eat Vegetoid, but it wasn't weakened enough. Fresh morning taste. I actually really need HP, because I'm going to die. Huh. Curses. Oh, this was the last time I saved. Wait, the cutscene already started. Oh. I wonder if I can get hit by that. Shut up, SCP Toolkit. I don't care, because I don't use a PS3 controller on my computer anymore. Mouse hole. I don't have the money to go buy the the cider again. I see Vegetoid and I want it. save point ahead. I don't know. I haven't played much of this game and I tend not to retain information whenever I watch something. Mmm, cha-cha. Cha-cha real smooth. Top middle. Okay. Our door is not an exit, it's simply a marks your rotation in perspective. Oh, I have the money now, though. the money, the money is mine. I won the money. Can I actually buy both now? I think I can. 
Yes, I can. Very nice. Wholesome spiders. Yes. I kind of hate spiders, but I'll pretend not to for now. Rotate. Switch. Um, don't explain this puzzle to me yet, by the way. Oh, oh boy. 4,030 zenny. Only 45,000... 980 more until I get Mother 3. Aw, oh, heck yeah. Someday I'll stream Mother 3. Just not yet. Cha-cha real smooth. Hey, where's the blue one? It's like back. Yes, it is. Quite nice. You can read this, press the blue switch. You can read this, press the red switch. Please give me the green. Heck yeah. This, this battle theme is actually pretty good, but it's not as good as the Delta Rune one, if you ask me. Rude Buster is so good. But this game has some pretty great music anyway, so it doesn't matter. What's over here, I wonder? Between you and me, I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to ask her. What a nice scenic view here. Hmm, what a useless room. I wish there was an item in there. That would have been a really good game design, but no, I didn't. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? There, there, I will heal you. Should not have left you alone for so long. I was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. It's... Well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Every time this old tree grows leaves, they fall right off. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is butterscotch cinnamon pie. Thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. Delicious. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. I don't. I hate it, in fact. Something burning? Um, make yourself at home. No mirror. Also, this song is so cozy. You've seen this type of plant, but do not know its name. It's called a cattail. Or a corn dog. They really do look like corn dogs. Room under renovations. It's you! Whoa! Or alternatively, it's just a head growing out of my head. 
It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha. A group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods. No more commonly as water sausages. But they were cattails. Tutorial's diary. I had the skeleton want a friend because she was feeling bonely. Wonderful. Scandalous, it's Toriel's soft drawer. Shrug a little bucket of snails. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, I have one of those in my house, too. Maybe it's the way you're dressed. Maybe. An empty photo frame, it's really dusty. box of kids' shoes and a disparity of sizes. I want the lights in my room to be off. I was trying to summon Uboa. Look at these cool toys! They don't interest you at all. Popping in bed. That's not Uboa! Found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Sorry for epilepsy. I, sorry about that. I should have probably thought about that. I am leaving. I don't know if I can do that yet. Size of the pie and something is too much for you to eat it. Wait for. There's a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. Yeah, I, I I stick my candy in the fridge whenever I'm not eating it. Feels wrong not to otherwise. Up already, I see. Um, I want to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. Also, prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, I perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? Yo, when can I go home? What? Th this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I am reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Sure. Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails have a chainsaw-like tongue called a regula. Alright, cool. I'm gonna go leave now. I think you should play upstairs instead. Her running towards you from behind like that is kind of scary. Like, it, it startled me at first. Not gonna lie. I don't know, I don't like the idea of something, somebody running up behind me. Like, especially if I can hear their footsteps. I have something to do. Stay here. Well, I'm leaving. I'm actually not watching Jess, Jess Hepatite. Toriel is sadder and messed up than I remember. Dang! Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. I'll be a good child and go upstairs. No. I will do no such thing. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I've seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they escort will kill you. I'm only do I'm only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. No. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Toriel's really sad. Like, oh my god. You wanna leave so badly? Mm. You're just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. 
Get ready for a sick battle theme! I love this battle. Check. Check 80, defense 80. Knows best for you. Couldn't think of any conversation topics. Ow! Ah! Ah! Spider sighted. You get the monster candy, you recover 10 HP. Get ready to watch me die a lot here. Ah! Oh, I almost avoided all damage. That was so sick. Almost. Ah! <laughs> I'm so bad at avoiding this. What are you doing? Let her find out herself. What? Attack her, run away! What are you proving this way? Fight me or leave? She won't even hit me anymore! Stop it. Me that way. Go away. Please, go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we don't have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. I'm not even have. I don't even have the option to run away anymore. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. Runs are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. I'm, I've seen that scene so many times and it still gets to me every time. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Uh, I can't see it, but I'm pointing at the screen. Goodbye, my child. Uh, Come here, Maddie, but uh, thank you. It's so just... She's so sweet. What happens if I go back, though? Can I?
Where she be? Is she actually still here? I don't think she is. Dang. Me trying to make a gradient be like... <laughs> clever. Very clever. You think you're like really smart, don't you? In this world, like, it's killed or be killed. So you're able to like play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. <laughs> I bet you like feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you like do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die, and you'll die, and you'll die, until you tire out of, like, trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration, or will you give up entirely on this world and, like, let me inherit the power, the control of it? I'm the prince of this world's future. Don't, like, worry, my little monarch. My plan is in regicide. This is, like, so much more interesting. I was trying to go for Valley Girl. Because that's what somebody suggested earlier. <laughs> Everybody's telling me to stop. Well, what voice should I give Flowey then? That won't kill my entire throat again. Hey, look! <gasps> it's the name of the game! Whoa! By Tobias Foxen. Give him an evil voice. Yeah, that's why I can't do it. Because it'll hurt my throaty. Hey, look, there's a stick. Evil voice will kill throat. Yeah. Let me go back. There's a camera hidden in the bushes. Toriel's still looking at me. I'm going to go with Valley Girl for the rest of the game. Hey, look, I saw sand. I'm very hungry. Give me the pizza. Where did this come from, Aquan? Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. No. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. What if I just gave Sans chills his voice? <laughs> I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus. He's actually a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. <laughs> Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. That's always one of my favorite gags. Sup, bro? You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. 
What have you been doing? Staring at this lamp. It's really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. Yes, Papyrus is 100% just Skeletor from He-Man. There's no, there's no way to get around it. I will. I can't do my Skeletor voice anymore though, because it'll hurt my, my throat. What if they were both chills? There's a vacuum cleaner downstairs. One moment. Please stop, okay. <laughs> I won't. I, I won't do that. But it, I will capture a human. <laughs> Wait, what if I made, uh, what if I made, what if I made Papyrus just Irwin from Billy and Mandy? I will capture a human, yo. <laughs> no, I'm not doing that. Then I, the Great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm, maybe this lamp will help you. Sand, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've got a ton of work done today. A skeleton. <gasps> Sands! Come on, you're smiling. I am and I hate it! Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get a little recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. Make everyone chills. That's a great idea. I really should do that. Ugh. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. I, I, I can't do that laugh. I, I started and I just, I, I, I gave up halfway through. Because I could feel the, the flesh in my throat start to shred. Eh? That was not good. Okay, you can come out now. It's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station, but there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Just a conveniently shaped lamp. You ought to get going. He might come back, and if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. I'm not doing the the chills voice for the entire thing. Hey, actually, sorry to bother you, but do you, can you do me a favor? Just thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous, even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. Whoa, he went the other way, but he's gonna be up ahead? How do you do that? Whoa. Use the box. I want the tough glove. Weapon attack five. A worn pink, pink leather glove for, for five-fingered folk. You equip tough glove. Oh, it's like tough love. I just realized that, that joke. It's so good. Okay. Attack, attack 12, defend seven. This teen comedian fights to keep a captive audience. Hey! Relatable.
You laugh at Snow Drake's pun. See? Left! That was wrong! Ow! Snow Drake is pleased with its cool joke. I like how its teeth just sort of shift back and forth. Look at how happy he is. Is this where the snowman? No. Nobody picked up. Ah! Woman! So, as I was saying about Undyne... Spin! Sand, oh my god, is that a human? Uh, actually, I think that's just a rock. Oh. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! Is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! Undyne will- I'm gonna- I'll be so popular, popular, popular! Ahem. Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. And then- THEN! I'm not sure what's gonna happen next. In any case, continue only if you dare! Yeah. I can't do my cackle anymore. I, I I can do like the beginning of it, but my throat locks up if I try to go any further. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye eye socket out for you. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the world captain sentry station. Who could have built this? You ponder. I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, not yet a very famous royal guardsman. Ice cap. Isn't this guy's name like Jerry? Attack 11, defense 4. The scene wonders why it isn't named Ice Hat. What a great hat, mine. But it's not weakened enough. Help! Fashion police! Oh god! Looks annoyed. Hello! My hat's up here! Compliment. You informed the ice cap. That is a very great hat. Envious? Too bad! I knew it! Oh, I don't know what I was gonna say. Um, slight problem. I don't know how to actually spare this. Seems defeated. Oh. Can I steal it now, though? Yes! And succeeded it melts in your hands. Oh no! Uh, ice cap is no more. Butts pie? Okay. Ice, oh, pfft. Attack one, defense zero without its cap. What can I say? You inform Ice Cap that it still looks fun. I wanted you to see me as cool. I do. Ice doesn't mind its identity. I'm proud of it. I've never seen that before. Also, I'm going to go back and actually heal really quick. 
Bro. Ice cap with no cap. I'm actually gonna run away. Cause I'm about to die. Hello, my hat is up here. Fine, I don't care. Ow. I'm gonna steal the hat every single time. Hi, Snow Drake. I've heard that one. Ow! I'm about to die again. Spider, don't. Oh no! I feel terrible. I, I didn't know that was a thing that could happen. Also, Daisy, come here. You're making your daily stream appearance. My sweet little baby. We love Daisy. The song sounds like it's from Mario Galaxy 2 to me for some reason. I don't even know why. I don't even know why. My girlfriend, she's at the end. She is starting to... Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was, if something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again! Dog pal. Oh my god, the eyebrow. Check. Attack 13, defense 7, easily excited by movement. Hobbies include squirrels. Don't move an inch. Wasn't planning on it. Pet doggo. What? I've been pet. <laughs> I remember this and it still makes me laugh every time. That face is so good. S s something pet me. Something that wasn't moving. I'm gonna need a dog treats for this. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Dang. I'm... Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. The idea of a blue stop sign pleases my brain. I like the idea of something that's normally red being blue. Lesser dog. <gasps> I didn't mean to do that. We're just gonna ignore that. Lesser dog, attack 12, defense 2. We have the stone dogger made by made of pomegranate. Ow. Barely lift your hand unless your dog got excited. Ow! Oh my god, it's been forever since I last saved. I didn't expect it to jump backwards. Battles are hard, I'm not gonna lie. Like.
Pekyang. Snowman. Hello, I am a snowman. I wanted to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please. Take a piece of me and bring it very far away. How am I doing? By I mean the piece of me I gave you. Doggy. Hello? Is anybody there? <laughs> Doggy. I hate that the fight option is the first option. That really bugs me. It's really hard. Oh, it didn't. Oh, that's so mean! I like how the tail just keeps wagging faster and faster. Pet lesser dog. I love this. May it's possible you may have a problem. Just a little bit. I like how its face is blending in with the text box. It's just absorbing it. That's precious, yeah. The tail. I forget how long you can do this for. Lesser dog is unpettable but appreciates the attempt. I love stupid garbage like this. Can you only go for it for this long? Or can it go to the bottom of the text box, I wonder? Okay, I don't think it can, yeah. Well, that was fun. I'm going back to the save point. Why did I do that? Please say to the end of the earth. I will. And by that I mean I'm putting you in the box. Hey, hey, hey. I 
thought I died. No, I did not. You were napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses. Oh, ho, ho, the human arrives in order to stop you. My brother and I have created some puzzles. I think we'll find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is an invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, the aura will administer a hearty zap. Sounds like fun, because the amount of fun you'll probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. I didn't even touch it yet. Sands, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the cord. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Right. I can't walk around. Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily, too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be as easy. It is designed by my brother, Sands. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> Pappy Roos and Sands from Undertale in Earthbound? What? Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks we made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. Hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Hello, would you like some nice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 G. Yeah. Muchas gracias, friend. Ball. Okay. Oh. It's like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow decahedron. Hmm. I've been thinking about selling treats, too. Want some fried snow? It's just 5G. Yeah. I mean, 50G. Really? How about 5,000G? 50,000G. That's my final offer. What? You don't have the money. Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. I see. His. Hers. Smell danger rating. Snow smell. Snowman. White rating. Can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell. Puppy. Blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Weird smell. Humans. Green rating. Destroy at all costs. Why am I green? But it said red. Also, do I even need to do this puzzle? Human, I hope you're ready for... Sands, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. You know what? Let's humor him. Open with paint.net. Okay. All right, well, I can already cross this one off because it's right there. <laughs> All right, let's see here. I see a monster. Here's cigars.
Um, y'all, y'all see any? I think some of them are diagonal. Oh, I hate diagonals. Um, oh, I see spring. And backwards? Yeah. Um, oh, I found sig. Hot. Uh, let's look for H. Here's hot. Sneltelatex or Sneltelix. That's skeletons. Um, Y'all see winter anywhere? Oh. Oh, I found it. That's tricky. Some of the words that aren't listed, such as, like, hi, where. I found mermaid. Robot. Um, I found robot. Um, I found summer. Now I just need to find fall. Found it. I've actually never done that before, so I'm amazed that I got that done so quickly. Uh, are there any hidden words, CC? Hit is one. Oh, I can't see under all these red lines that I wrote. <laughs> Um. Oh, I found it. There we go. Okay. Cool. I did it. I solved the puzzle. Nice. Nice shot. Sans, the human is escaping. You made the puzzle too hard. Hey, you, get back here. Okay. Sans, that didn't do anything. Whoops, I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, junior job was easy the hardest. What? Really, dude? The easy peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Jumble. Ha! Uh, yes. Humans must be very intelligent. They also find Junior Jumble so difficult. <laughs> Thanks for saying Junior Jumble just to appease my brother. Yesterday he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Heck yeah. It's a note from Pyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. Little do you know, this spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize you aren't progressing. Thoroughly duped by the, again by the great papyrus. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold it's stuck to the table. I'd still eat it though. It's an unplugged microwave. All, all the settings say spaghetti. Yeah. Knowing the mouse might one day find- oh wait, I already- 
I already read that one. Dog marriage. Quite the warning. Ice cap. Ugh. Jerry. <coughs> da Daisy. <coughs> Daisy. I think Daisy was choking on something. I think she's okay now, though. I need to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoyed. Why wow, you guys suck at this? I love Jerry. Ow. It's Jerry. Yeah. It smells like a wet pillow. <laughs> Attack zero, defense 30. Everyone knows Jerry. It makes it two seconds longer. Guys, it's cold. Does anyone care? Better a hatter than a hater. I love Jerry. See, laughs. Dad, Dad was wrong. Ow. Ow. Huh? Did they ditch me? Some friends. Jerry sneezes out, covering its nose. You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. Oh, I wanted to not do that, though. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Wow. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell. Identify your smell. Dog bass. I like that song. Hmm, here's that weird smell. Makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! Did that say, oh, I thought that said dogs assault you. I was like, that already happens enough in real life. Dog of me. He has been of dog Aressa. O knows only what he smells. Ow. Spider don't. around in the dirt and the snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Take my wife's, please. Ow. Ow. What am I supposed to do there? Dog sniffy again. If you're rolling around in there, you smell all right. What? It smells like a... Are you actually a little puppy? Go under the axes when they jump? Okay, understood. Let's kick human tail. I'm not a human though. I'm actually an alien. Okay, so... So now what? 
pet. Wow, pet by another pet. Okay. Do that, and then that. Opposite the direction it's going. Okay, yeah. Pet the dog Arisa. A dog that pets dogs. Amazing. Success. Oh my god, their eyes. Dogs can put other dogs. A new world has been opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. No problemo. Oh, this is my favorite puzzle. I like these. These are fun. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? Ate it. Really? Wowee. No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pots that you could ever want. Hi, friend. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. <laughs> that is absolutely not the... <laughs> that it's supposed to portray, but I don't care. Human. Hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face! Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere to be found. I suppose what I'm saying is, Were not human? I, the great papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to go with the answer. Hilda wins. Wow, you solved it. And you did it all without my help. Incredible. I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. <laughs> Good job on solving it so quickly. Didn't even need my help. Which is great. Because I love doing absolutely nothing. Same. Hey, look, it's Metaton. Hey, I glitch 23. It's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Elphis. Do you see these tiles? Once I throw the switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles, alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through them if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the, wa the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide, you will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How about... I like this puzzle. It's too bad that they... Uh... Well... I like the idea of this puzzle, and I really wish that they did more with it than just... That. I know they do something with it later, though. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been brewing a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year we'll, even, we'll make something even edible. The payoff, yeah. <laughs> 
Seems like the base of a snow dog. I've seen that joke before, so it didn't get me as much as it did the first time, but I love that joke anyways. All the moments in this are so iconic. It's the broken head of a snow dog. Seems like the base of a snow dog. I want to make a snow dog next year. On the, on the floor inside is a box, box of Palmer raisins. Dog. Dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. Kept trying to build the snow dog that expressed its own emotions, but as it built, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. So it got longer and longer, and added more and more snow until it was rather sad to watch. But I couldn't turn away. Oh. Sands. How do you write on snow with a red marker? Curses. <gasps> no! Shoot. Don't you just go in a circle for this, actually? Wait. Yeah, I was gonna say, like... Shmoove and... Then I get, like, some of my... Yeah. It's such a janky game. Even with how, like, popular it's gotten and how good it is, it's still, like, extremely janky. Yeah! You remember stocking full of chicken nuggets. That's a little better. I love this thing so much. It's probably one of my favorite designs in this game. Remember the shirt that says, I'm with stupid and points inward. That's a little better. Remember the lenticular bookmark of a smug teen winking. A weight has been lifted. It's janky, but I still love it. Yeah. Griff shot. Attack 16, defense 8. Some pranks decorated it as a prank. Or some teen... Did I say some pranks decorated as a teen at first? I think that's what I said. Yeah, big fan of that enemy. Say, hey, are you following me? Yeah. What's this? The door. Oh. Thanks for telling me what I didn't know. So I know that there's extra content added in the Switch version. Also, I, this has been bothering me for the past, like, five minutes. I didn't mean to do all of that. I just accidentally pressed the button. I was like, you know what? I'll go with it. Mew Mew? Yeah. How do I access that? I wish to know. Hi. Hi, new person. Sands and Papyrus House. Got it. Don't tell me any more then. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold, a snow puff. 
Eh, there's 30G inside this. What is this? What a tiny dog has. Look. <laughs> this part. <laughs> yeah! Love that. Greater dog. Attack 15, defense 8. It's so excited that it thinks fighting is just play. Stonkingly buff pupper, yeah. Too far away to pet, you just pet the air. I love the face and the spear. That's like the, the cherry on top. It's not exciting enough to play with. I got hit by all three of those! And I haven't saved in forever! No. Oh, I wish that save points were. A bit closer together, maybe. That'd be a very nice feature. <laughs> Sad. Sad indeed. Oh. Oh, I thought that this was... Oh, it's because I spent so long on other stuff. Duh. It was the illusion of taking forever. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay, beckon. You call the greater dog. It bounds towards you, flecking slobber into your face. Undecorate gift try. Oh, I need to do that. I need to do that again. No. Cute friend. Oh, I just noticed that it has the face on its, like, gauntlet. Oh. Mario Paint music, that's all I'll say. Yeah. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> Ooh, I love that so much. It's so dumb. Also, I was not moving there, but okay. Curses. I'm about to die again. I can totally feel it. No! <laughs> what just happened?
tiny house. Hey, hey. Okay, I should probably heal this time. Also, that it said the spider don't with a with an apostrophe. I did not expect to have this much trouble with this boss. Walking. You're getting good? Oh, thanks. <laughs> I remember this part. Human, this is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold the gauntlet of deadly terror. Yeah, I love the dog on a string up there. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the hold up? The hold up? What hold up? I'm, I'm about to activate it now. That uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human one. Yeah, we can't, we can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Anyway, it goes. What are you looking at? This was not. This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. <laughs> I don't know what my brother's gonna do now. If I were you, I'd understand. Make sure you understand blue attacks. Looks pretty activated to me. Yeah, that dog was pretty, like, threatening. Hi, friend. I always remember this lady. I don't know why. I always have. I like the purples with the yellows. It's really pretty looking. Imagine how decimated Frisk would be if Papyrus actually used more than 5% of its power. Yeah. Say hello. Hiya! Welcome to Snowden. Can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital. You don't look like a tourist. You're here by yourself. Wanna know what I do here in Snowden? 
Groby has food. Library has information. If you're tired, you can rest it, take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. If you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. Town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back in the back there in back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up a camp here in Snowden. Oh, and don't even think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked there for ages. So unless you're a ghost or can burrow under the door, forget about it. Life isn't the same as usual. A little claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can get our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? Bye now. Come again sometime. I'm so glad to have something to equip for defense. Oh, it's so nice. Finally. Anyways. Buy those. Hi, friend. Welcome to the Snowed Inn, Snowden's premier hotel. One night is 80G. I don't think I will. Because I can literally heal right outside. That's a Nice feature. Well, that was cool. Blocked. Dang. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know the sign is misspelled. But what if something cool happens if you sleep there? I don't know, does something cool happen? I don't remember. Look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumble, aren't you? Maybe. I always like this character. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? Everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crises, dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. This guy is in the mayor's office. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. I know. It doesn't from what I remember. Lame. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. Tee hee. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. I wonder why. It's because she's doing a whole Pluto versus Goofy thing. Hiya, you look like you had a great sleep, which is incredible, because you were only up there for about two minutes. <laughs> Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. <laughs> oh, okay. That makes sense. Frisk sleepy. Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating a tree like horns, so we started giving pre monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. A carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are dressed from Santa and to various locals. So if there's ever a problem, skeleton will tell a fish lady all about it. That's politics. Oh my god, I forgot about that line. I always hated this fish. I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. This thing is the thing that runs the hospital in the Delta Rune. 
Hmm, isn't human food different from monster food? It sure does, does things like spoil. When you eat it, it passes all the way through your body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. No matter where I go, it's always the same menu, same people. I'm trying to think of... Make a statement like, attach a leash for me and take me for a walk, please. Wish real, real word. No, 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 I can't speak. I want to play cards. Better watch where you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump in your lap and give you lots of love and attention. He won't talk to me. And I've heard they have things called bathrooms. Oh, that's good. I will say, I do like the song in there. Funny sand song, I know, but... Let's play Monsters and Humans. You aren't gonna make me be the human again, are you? Ah, uh, to be young again. Sure, world sure felt boundless. Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, uh, my patience rewards me. Ah. Uh, block Oh hey, isn't this where you put the snowman? I just going on a journey. I remember that. Mailbox is labeled papyrus. Dang, it's empty. Relatable. Ice is an allegory for frisk. Other medium is still in my still my favorite track because the game is just so chill. Yeah. All right. Oh, that was a pretty good pun, though. I won't lie. All right, I think that's gonna be about it for now. Cause I don't wanna go for another four hours like I did, or I don't wanna go for five hours like I did yesterday. So I'm gonna stop here before I get carried away. Thank you for watching. Uh, I'm excited to play this game again. It's been a long time and I miss it. All right, I will see you later. Bye-bye.